Hi, uh, Dr. Math Tech here. I'm going to, this time around, I'm going to show you, I'm going to do a um, new variable in this particular section here called Z, um, I'm going to call it Z, um, Z Learn. And I'm going to actually compute the Z score for Z Learn. So um, hopefully you'll learn something from this. I um, it help somebody. So we're going to calculate the Z score. So here I'm just going to take this learn here. I'm just going to um, I'm just going to copy and paste it. So you see here I have the same exact values here and there. Go to variable view, and I'm going to click right here, and I'm just going to call this um, Z learn. Okay. And from this, I'm going to create a I'm going to actually create another column that's going to actually give me the Z score. So but for me to be able to do the Z, um, Z learn, remember I have to also, to do this, I have to get the mean and the standard deviation of this. And remember that a Z score is actually the score uh, minus the, um, the mean divided by the standard deviation. So we have to do some analysis here, some descriptive statistics. So as you see here, uh, Select it. I'm going to select my my new one here. Okay, and then I'm going to look at some of the options here. I don't need the maximum min. I only all that. Just the mean and the standard deviation I do in this case. Okay, it's calculating that. So now I see the mean is about 10.86, and the standard deviation is 4.091. So now I'm going to take that and I actually want to um, go back here and we're going to comp and transform and we're going to compute. So this time I'm going to compute this value. This is my um, Z learn and I'm going to subtract the mean from that and the mean was uh, I think it was 10.86 I do believe it was. Uh, let's see here. Is 10.86, and then I'm going to divide by the standard deviation, which is um, 4.09. 4.091. Okay. Now that we have all those things in place, um, also I need to get a target variable here. This is what I'm actually going to call my Z score. And you can do that again if you would like. So Z score is equal to Z learn minus the, the scores in that column. Um, I'm, I'm sorry, Z score is equal to Z learn um, minus the, av um, the mean divided by the standard deviation. Then I'm going to click OK. And you see there now the Z scores for this have now been calculated. So I have Z learn here, and then these are the exact Z scores um, for Z learn. And then you can always go back in and truncate these variable, um, truncate these numbers in the back end by going here and changing um, how many decimal places and things that you um, you want, um, etc., cetera, etc. Cetera. So I hope you learned something. Um, this is how you calculate a Z-score. Thank you for watching. If you want to see anything else, as always, contact me and I'll see what I can do. Bye-bye.